Good afternoon, y'all. So, I'm headed to go get my hair done in a little bit, but I wanted to go ahead and open this um, Amazon order. I ordered three, I think it was three sleeves of pods. I'm gonna open the package now um, of Nespresso pods from Amazon. So let me show you the ones I got. Uh, give me one second. Okay, so these are the pods. I ordered the Venezio because this uh, particular <clears throat> flavor is going out of stock. I think it's June the 30th. Um, and for some reason, I can't find it on the website. I may go and like type it in the search engine and see if it'll come up. But when I look through the pods, I don't see it. So Amazon had them um, $33 for three sleeves. And then I had a $10 credit. So it's like $23, three sleeves. You can't beat that. So they just showed up. And of course, it's already been disinfected. Um, yeah, so excited. I got this in my first order and really, really liked it. And Happy Salish Mommy mentioned that they would be going out of stock. So I said, well, let me just get three. Um, I've already had my coffee for the day, but... I may have another one just so I can have some of these. Hey y'all, today is Saturday, May the 30th, and I am headed to Chick-fil-A. I'm going to pick us up um, some lunch. It's a little bit after one. I was craving a salad and we are out of lettuce and I'm not due, like well, salad mix, and I'm not due to go to the grocery store until tomorrow. Um, I could go today, but I have other things that I have to get done. So I'm going to make my grocery shopping for tomorrow so that I can get up as early as possible and get it done. So i um, headed to Chick-fil-A. I got my hair done yesterday. We just did a nice little braided updo. I'm really excited about it. I love it. Um, my stylist and I have come to the conclusion that because I have now been a straight natural for July makes a year, um, we're going to do the six month on, six month off method. So basically what that means is we will do braided styles all throughout the spring and summer months and then I will straighten my hair in the fall and the winter. Um, I know that some people love to like wear their hair straight all year round. I'm all about the health of my hair. As much as some people don't care about a curl pattern, I do. I still want my hair to be able to bounce back if I need it to. And it is still in relatively great condition. I don't have a lot of like straight pieces and a lot of heat damage given my stylist only does one pass when it comes to my hair. So we don't do multiple passes through the hair. We do one pass. Uh, we do a blow dry session with lots of thermal treatment and then we um, do one pass to straighten and one pass for the curls. As you guys know when I get it straightened I, I normally have it curled for the first like few days to a week and then I kind of just let it do its little thing after that. Um, and sometimes I can stretch my straight style for three weeks. So that's what we've come up with. So I had individuals for two months. I'm gonna hold on to this braided updo. Hopefully it'll last about three weeks. Um, and then after that, we're gonna see if we're gonna do another braided updo or if we're gonna go in and do um, individuals again. More than likely, I'll do one more braided updo and then we'll go into two months of individuals because at that point, it'll be September and it'll be time for me to get my hair straightened again. Um, so I love that about her. I love the fact that I have a stylist that, I mean, she's been in the game for like 30 years, y'all. She's been doing hair for a very long time. She specializes in natural hair. Um, so I, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So I'm loving this braided updo. Clarence loves it. So you know when your man like it, you, you, you're even more ecstatic about it. Um, yeah. So it's a little after one. Like I said, I'm headed to Chick-fil-A. I was craving a salad. Kaden wants a salad as well. Clarence, he actually just got off work. So he grabbed something on his way in. Um, so I'm gonna grab us a quick lunch. We had a very light breakfast. Um, I was up fairly early because Cam had a crazy night last night where he was just crying, 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 crying. And if he wasn't crying, he was wide awake. So we really 
really did not go to sleep until about 3 or 4 this morning and then I was up by like 7 30 um kitchen duty and all that stuff got some bottles to wash when I get back and then I have a waxing appointment at 3 o'clock that I'm hoping you know I'll make in due time for that um let's see what else is going on in the world today we really don't have anything planned um cam is officially two months as of today and he has his two month checkup monday i do believe he has to get shots so if anything i will probably just be stopping at the grocery store for um some baby tylenol because that's something i don't have but i'm not new to this i'm true to this uh <laughs> Uh, this is my second child. I know that I need to kind of send him in with a little Tylenol in his system or Motrin so that he doesn't catch a fever. Um, what else? I got my nails done last week. I got my pedicure last week. Hair is done. And then the final maintenance is me getting my waxing. And I'm at this point, I'm trying to limit my things to like once a month. Um, until this whole COVID thing is over. I'm in Georgia. I know they opened the, the state and all of that, but I have a newborn and I don't want to be all, you know, and just out here all willy-nilly. I'm turning into the Chick-fil-A now. So, um, yeah, I just want to be mindful. What's up, y'all? So, it's Sunday. Saturday. We didn't do nothing, like, nothing. So, I don't have anything to vlog. Um, but today is Sunday. It is um, a little bit after 3 o'clock. A very, very late start to the day because Cam was so fussy again last night. So, um, I just kind of ended up like going to sleep literally at like 6 o'clock this morning. So, I didn't wake up till a little bit later and then we, um, had lunch and I made a grocery list and said, okay, let me get out here and let me get these groceries. So I'm headed to the grocery store now. Um, and then when I get home, I'm probably going to put the groceries up, do a little household cleaning and try to get a workout in for the day. And I'm going to order Caden, Caden, y'all, I get my kids mixed up. I'm going to order Cam a swing. I think I mentioned it in a couple of vlogs back. Before he was born, I had gone ahead and purchased everything. Um, the car seat and the bounce bouncer and the stroller, the bassinet, um, clothing, his diaper bag, the little thing that you strap to yourself, like the baby carrier, which he freaking hates, just FYI. Um, but I didn't order a swing and I didn't order a swing because with Caden, I didn't need the swing till he was about three months. Um, and I, even though I got it early on, he didn't get into it till he was about three months. Well, Cam turned two months yesterday. He needs this swing because he is so cranky if he is not being held. So that being said i said i'm going to make it my mission today because this is the third night in a row that i have been up late with him that i and 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 during the day i can't get much done because he wants me to hold him and hold him and hold him i said i'm gonna go ahead and get a swing so i'm gonna do a little bit of research on like which one i want um i saw one at target so when I get home, I'll probably get online and go ahead and place the order for the swing because, I mean, you guys, literally, I can't take anymore. I'm just like, this this, this child, is he's unhappy. He is unhappy. So, I just pulled up at Sprouts. I'm just going to run in really quickly and get our produce and try to get in and out. Um... If I can bring you guys along, I will. If not, I'll see you guys in this next clip. But yes, today is grocery shopping day.
right, you guys. So quick grocery haul. Picked up some of the Quaker instant oatmeal, just the original kind. I like to like flavor it myself um, for in the morning, some quick breakfast um, ideas in the morning. Picked up more of the Activia yogurt. We really like this and I had a coupon for it this week. So I made sure to get two of them. Um, I've really been liking this brand of chicken sausage. They didn't have the one I like. We had um, sun-dried tomatoes, mozzarella, and basil. Um, it was sold out, so I'm gonna try this bourbon apple kind. Hopefully we like that. Um, Kaden has been asking me for chocolate pudding, so I picked up a pack of that. They had the chewy bars on sale, so I picked up some just, you know, little snack options for him throughout the week. Um, so I picked up the peanut butter and chocolate chip and then the big chewy the big chewy chocolate chip i'm gonna replace those paper towels don't worry fruit snacks he loves the star wars kind so i got three packs of those so they were 99 cents each um picked up two pounds of the raw shrimp because we like that these were two for five i love the uh pretzel chips i picked up the cinnamon sugar flavor and i picked up the everything bagel uh, deli style also picked up some of the nature's valley um bars because kaden likes these as well and i like this particular one the one with the almonds also picked up some deli cheese and meat had them cut some colby jack for us and i had them cut some of the um pepper turkey breast so i got two pounds of those and then picked up these pot pies. Kaden likes these, so I've been picking them up again. Just little lunch options. Of course, his little ham and cheese lunch kits. Um, I really like the Simple Truth ones. I picked up the Juicy Juice, 100% juice this week for him because um, it was on sale. And he got two for like under four bucks. Picked up some salsa because we are gonna have Taco Tuesday. And we we're out of salsa, so I picked that up. I also picked up just this variety pack of chips. This is the one that we like um, the most, just the originals mix. All right, y'all. So I went ahead and put up all the groceries. I'm about to cut the strawberries, pineapples, wash the grapes. Um, this is the fruit we'll be having for the week. And we'll be also having, um, I bought... What did I buy? I bought oranges, like the little clementine oranges. And I brought regular oranges and apples and things of that nature. But this is all the fruit that has to be washed. And then we still have raspberries and blackberries down there too. So fruit for the week. Um, and I'm also going to get these green beans going. Tonight we're having salmon, green beans, and um, sweet potatoes for dinner. Camera. You're two months already. Hey, Chunkamonk. Hi, Chunka, Chunka, Chunkamonk. Come on, let's get you undressed. Mm, ask Daddy to do this for me. Ew. You're so gassy. So gassy. Mm -hmm. That's probably what I was gonna like. You wanna give it? To me, it was just like whatever. <laughs> you feel me, young breezy? Yeah, I feel you. So, Cam has to get three shots today. Um. I'm waiting on the doctor to come <clears throat> and give him the shots now. I'm a little nervous, so I'm not going to lie. I'm about to give him some Motrin when we get home um, so he doesn't get like feverish and sick and stuff. But I know he's like a hollerer and he's over here like going to sleep now. So I'm really nervous because they're going to give him the shot and he's probably going to scream his head off. But we're going straight home from here and then I'll go back in and grab the... Um, Motrin for him, so he's not all cranky. Alright, y'all. So, as you saw, Cam has his... He had his six-week checkup. I am getting ready to 
stopped by the UPS store. I am recycling Nespresso pods. And I had an order from Amazon that um, it was a highlighter that I ordered, like a Becca highlighter, and it arrived like shattered. So I'm gonna go ahead and return this as well. And via the return, you can do it via the UPS store. Um, so I also need to stop at Target to get Cam some baby Motrin and um, a probiotic. Um, his doctor suggested that for his gassiness. Uh, what else do I need to do? I need to grab a box of diapers. This is the first box of diapers I've had to buy since he's been born. Um, what else? Oh, I need to see if they have that swing. So I can go ahead and, and purchase that. And uh, that's it, I think. I don't know. Oh, and I have to stop at Sprout because yesterday I purchased two things from Thayer. I purchased the toner and I purchased the facial spray. And I think they got left in the store because I, they did not come into my home. And I called and they told me to stop in the store. So I'm going to go ahead and pick that up. Um, and that's about it. So I will see you guys when I like get out and about. But I want to go ahead and start running these errands so I can get the day done and over with. So I was able to do my return to the UPS store for my Nespresso pods. I was able to recycle those and then I was able to do my Amazon return with no problem. So oh, oh, I just sprayed my gloves with Lysol, so don't worry y'all. Um, let's get to Sprout now. All right, y'all. So they were super super sweet and um gave me my toners and everything it was no problem she was able to pull up the transaction she found it super easily all she needed was the last four digits on my um credit card so gave her that and she was able to pull it up um so that's what prayer will do y'all i had a positive customer service experience because i was just not here for it being a problem i'm just letting y'all know now i was like i do not have time for no problems because I know that I purchased it and I know that it was not in my cart. Um, so, there we go. They got everything handled for me and now I'm off to Target and that only took about five or 10 minutes. So, here we go.